Hello, and welcome to the second video in our tutorial series on how to use the eRecall Studio app, which is available on the Apple App Store and Google Play Store. The eRecall Studio app has three different recording options available for our ERS community. The first, and the one we will be discussing today, is single session for singers, solo instrumentalists, singers with their instruments, and also for karaoke recordings. The second is live session for bands of two or more musicians to meet instantly in real time or to schedule a date and time to record their session using our calendar feature. And lastly, the third option is our open session where one hosting member will upload an mp3 and play their instrument or vocals and post an open session where other ERS members will audition and contribute their instrumental or vocal recording. The hosting member can then select the various recordings preview them individually or in a mix together and choose the recordings they would like in the final recording before posting to the ERS platform, where he or she can then view and share on social media. To begin a single session, open the ERS app and click on the hamburger icon on the upper left corner to access the main menu. Click on single session and select your song by uploading an mp3 file. You can upload a cover song or your original music. You have the option to edit the title of your session. Before you click start, it is highly recommended to turn on your phone's do not disturb mode by swiping down from the top of your phone screen and clicking the do not disturb icon. After clicking start, complete your recording of the song and click stop. You will then have the option to re-record or save the recording. If you're satisfied with your recording, click save and your single session will be uploaded. Please do not turn off your phone and keep the ERS app in the foreground while uploading and do not switch to another app. In the ERS feeds or personal feeds page or in my recordings page, find your single session and tap on it to play. You have the option to share your recordings with your friends by tapping on the share icon. Please note, when recording to use plug-in type earplugs or headphones with a good microphone. Most Bluetooth headphones can cause a lag in your recordings and do not record instruments well, although some might be sufficient. To have a more improved audio quality, you can use an audio interface for a more direct and higher quality recording. You can use one of the three audio interfaces available on Amazon. The links by phone input type can be found here at eRecordStudioStore.com slash ERS-Recommended-Hardware. To use ERS app for karaoke, click on Single Session, upload a voiceless track, and play the song through your phone speaker or through a speaker. Do not use earplugs and sing into your phone's microphone along with the voiceless backing track. Your phone's microphone will record both your vocals as well as the backing track. Make sure to test the volume levels and adjust them so that both your voice and the backing track can be heard at proportional levels. You can also use an audio interface by splitting the voice using a microphone and the backing track from a speaker and record. We hope this gets you started recording solo sessions on ERS and we can't wait for you to try our other session types where you can collaborate with other musicians. Be sure to watch our other tutorials on how you can create open sessions as well as live sessions. And remember to share your moments of joy on ERS.